Streptococcus, or more commonly known as strep throat. Now, as most of us may know this as strep throat, the scientific name for it is Streptococcus pyogens, and it comes from the Bacilli class. Now, there are many types of Streptococcus, not all of them are just strep throat, but the one we're going to be talking about is group A Streptococcus, which is strep throat. The Streptococcus pathogen is a gram-positive, non-motile, and non-pore-forming spherical bacteria. It is uncommon to see each individual spherical pieces of bacteria kind of just floating around on their own. Most of the time they come together and they form chains. Now lucky for us, this pathogen only affects humans and it doesn't really affect any other animals, so go us, I guess. Symptoms of Streptococcus are things such as rash, fever, sore throat, any flu-like symptoms. This pathogen can be transferred simply by touch, uh, if you're around somebody else who had the infection, and if you are around anything they had touched. So basically, if you touch anything they touched and there was leftover like mucus or something, and it got into a cut or you breathed it in or it entered your body in some way, you would be infected. The pathogen would enter your body and then it would move straight to your throat. So once it gets into your throat, it starts kind of picking away and causing infections and it kind of feeds on your flesh basically. And thus you have been infected with strep throat, but don't worry. You're not going to die. This can be simply treated with antibiotics. Simple as that. Now for some interesting facts. So in the United States, they estimated that 11,000 to 13,000 people have been infected with strep throat. Um, strep throat will mostly infect kids who are like really young or teenagers, not usually older people. And every year, between uh, 1,100 and 1,600 people die from this. So yeah, that's all for fun facts. So that's all I got on the Streptococcus pathogen. I hope you guys enjoy, and 